Hi friends, in this video I'm going to talk about how I failed in office meetings. I'm going to share some of the learning experience that I had. Yes, I failed in facilitating some of the meetings in office. I'm going to share a small technique which helped me to facilitate the meetings in a better way. It didn't solve all the problems but this small technique helped me to improve the way I facilitate the meeting. Let me share my experience. Yes, as a senior person, I usually conduct some meetings within the team. So I'm responsible for facilitating the office meeting, drive the discussion and try to find out a solution out of the discussion. But the challenge is whenever I host a meeting, I was not able to facilitate properly and come up with the proper solution because I was not able to narrow down the topic. I go to the meeting with an abstract topic, so I'm not able to narrow down the topic. The second point is I'm not able to handle when the team start a discussion about important out of scope topic. For example, during the meeting, someone will ask a question which is very important, but it is out of scope. Then what will happen? The entire team will start discussing about it. So we'll not be able to utilize the time if we this is one of the challenge I had. Important out of scope topic. And the last challenge is during the meeting we had a lot of discussions but at the end of the meeting I'm not able to conclude with action items or solution. So these are the challenges I faced during my office meetings. Actually speaking I don't know how to handle these challenges. I don't have a solution but I recently learned something which helped me to improve the office meetings. So I'm going to share one small technique which helped me to improve the meeting a little bit. If you look at this table in the first column I have I have specified the way I usually keep the meeting title for example health category tech discussion health category test and health portal API creation so this is how I usually keep the meeting titles very abstract but now I change the way I conduct the meeting I change the way I keep the meeting title so what I did was instead of keeping very abstract for example health category tech discussion I change the way I will call shall we identify top three solutions for health portal categories so within 30 to 30 minutes the entire team will try to find an answer for this very specific question instead of keeping very abstract too broad I keep it very specific so what happens at the end of the meeting I will ask myself did I get an answer for this particular question so I have a very specific question and I will make a note of very specific answer so by asking questions the entire team will focus on finding out an answer so what happens during the meeting when somebody has an important question but out of scope question so as a facilitator i will ask is this related to this question that we are trying to find an answer okay the team will say no so let's focus on a solution for this question so it's possible that i can bring back the team towards this solution so these are the benefits i found out using this technique we are able to focus on specific question or goal during the meeting and the entire team is striving to get an answer for the question and any out of scope topic is discussed it can be avoided immediately and the fourth one is we can efficiently everyone in the team can efficiently use the time so finally I enter any meeting discussion with a specific question and once the discussion is over and the meeting is over I ask myself did I get the answer for this specific question if I don't get a specific answer out of this meeting then I do a follow-up meeting to get the specific answer so this is one of the small technique which helped me to improve my office meetings if you have any other tips please share in the comment section so that we all can learn hope this small information is helpful all the best for your career please subscribe to any TV channel. Thank you.